So do we have any Muslim want to answer? So the idea of Muslims rejecting Christianity as a Christ can be found in the Bible. The Bible says, who is the Antichrist? Who is the Antichrist? The answer is the one who denied the Father and the Son. That is Muhammad. As simple as that. This is why if there is a priest in some churches because there is some false priest everywhere, they say to you that we and Muslims will believe in the same God, they are liars. They are scam. They are fraud. They are servant of the devil. We don't believe in the same God. Our Father first, our God, is a spirit. Is there God is spirit? Muslims believe that God have no spirit and he is not a spirit. So even the nature of God is different. We as a Christian believe in the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit. Do the Muslims believe in such a God? No. So how a liar he says to you that we and Muslims, we share the same God. We don't. How somebody claim to be a Protestant or Catholic or Orthodox. This is why always when you go to a church, ask the priest there what he think about Islam. Do we believe the same God? If he say yes, he is a garbage. He have nowhere to be close to be considered as a priest or a servant of God. The Lord, he said, from their fruit you shall know them. And a person who says to you, we believe in the same God, that is his fruit, the fruit of the devil. In 1 John chapter 2 it says, who is the Antichrist? Who is the Antichrist? Isn't it the one who denied Jesus, the Christ? So this is number one form of the Antichrist. The one who denied Jesus to be the Christ. And by denying Jesus the Christ to be the Christ, or by denying that the Messiah is the Son of God. Islam denied the Messiah. They changed his name. They called him Isa. Islam believe or teach that Mary, she is the sister of Aaron. And Isa is the grandson of Amran, which is the father of Moses. So they changed the identity. They changed the rank of Jesus as God in earth, who come in the flesh. They changed the nature of Jesus. And they changed the nature of God. Their God is not spirit. And he have no spirit. So who is this God? He is the devil. He taught people to lie. He taught people to rape. He taught people to kill in the name of God. And Jesus says time will come and people will kill you thinking they are doing favor to God. Which God? Their God. Who is the liar? But he who denies that Jesus is the Christ. He is Antichrist who denied the Father and the Son. I mean to that. Any time you meet someone, he claimed to be a priest. He is teaching in a church. Expose him. Not only leave the church. You have a duty because he would deceive many Christians. If they kick you out of the church, no problem. Don't break the law. Go out, stand in the road. When people come, ask them the question, how this guy says that Islam is the same God when their God is not a spirit. And the, the Bible says clearly that the one who denied the Father and the Son is Antichrist, and that is Islam. Isn't it the Bible says, cursed will be the one who bring other than the scriptures? Quran is other scriptures. 600 years after Jesus. 
cursed is the one let him be cursed the one who who bring other than this is scripture doesn't matter who Islam or non Islam so Muhammad is cursed so how dare you to say we believe in the same God